This should be interesting. It's another product from the wild world of Willy Doo. He's the guy, he's out there on the internet. He's a surfer, professional in fact. He's looking for the next big wave. This is probably not it. Maybe it's it, I don't know. I'm optimistic today. This is another product that he saw online that he thought might be interesting. It's called Knops, control your volume. Excuse me, what, uh, control your, what, uh, analog, personal volume control? Whose volume, what volume, what are we talking about? Audio, music, no! For the real world. Audio control for your life, uh, ah? Uh? I know, confusing. In fact, I said to Jack, we're gonna do a video on audio control for life. And he was like, it's confusing. That's why we need to address it. They're out there on the internet saying that they've solved everything. You know how it goes with these startups. It's all, they found the best thing ever. This is some kind of thing. You stick it in your ears, like her. She's cool. It's usually what I... Knobs is the world's first volume button for your ears. Our acoustic hearing solution offers you total control over the sounds that surround you. Filter out respectively 10 dB, 20 dB, and 30, what? No lag, no radiation, no gimmicks? Radiation, sheesh. It's an earplug. Obviously there's no radiation. My hat has no radiation, did you? You didn't know that though. Holy, well, you gotta talk to them about the marketing, okay? Talk to them about the marketing, get back to these people. Now I travel a lot, I do wear earplugs. I'm a bit of an aficionado. I feel like they could be used more in certain environments. It can be really helpful for focus and things like this. That is what it looks like. That's crazy, that's cool on its own. And then this turns and it locks in at different points, I suppose for each different setting. So you get a couple of knobs. They are labeled left and right and they have this kind of staged adapter, which I'm a fan of. Holy smokes, but they didn't end it there. Foam tips, this is that, I believe it's called comply foam. Some people, you know, they don't even, you don't even have the same size ears. You can actually have one size for one ear, another for the other. That's it. Here's how you position it, and then you start to control the volume. It sort of feels like you bought a pair of earbuds, when in reality, they're just super high-end earplugs. How much are these, Will? No. Will just told me these are $100, and that's rude. Let me try them out. Ah, oh, okay. I mean, I certain, I hear everything. Let me make an adjustment here, okay. Okay. Maybe this is the wrong tip for me. I'm gonna go with the comply foam here. I think I got a big canal, boys. Okay, now we're talking. I don't know if these type of tips make very much sense. Now I have the comply foam tips on there. I'm not hearing a lot of bass in my own voice. Air conditioner sound is not as loud as with them completely off right now. Well, maybe you should get in here. This is your thing, you gotta stand by it. If you're gonna put your mouth where your money is, then you better put your money where your mouth is. That's well. You. This is your doing. Does it work though? Is this a game to you, Will? Are you hearing me right? <laughs> is this all fun and games to you, Will? Yeah. You come in here? You're playing games now? Yeah. Do I look like I'm playing games? Do you feel like you're in a suction? Yeah, it's like sort of the suction effect. There's a fishbowl effect happening now. Right, I'm gonna go right. to the final setting. Ooh, can you hear me? Your voice is 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 much more muffled now. This is the equivalent, I think, of the, the full effect of if you just took this, the full effect of the isolation right now. Right, right. Does it mess around with your inner ear? Like, does it make you queasy or anything like that? Hello? this again <laughs> this is ridiculous this maybe people are working in these open office environments but I think most people are gonna have headphones on they're just gonna be listening to something yeah I mean especially at a hundred dollars I could be like that's a product that should exist if it was like maximum 25 and like skip the cool box and the marketing money on the lingo and you make it seem as though you're buying something that's like more than it is. If it's gonna cost $100 to make something like this and you're gonna put that up against something that's $2 that's that, the ratio is too much. You can have this product. It's just so imperative that the price reflects the functionality. Absolutely, I totally agree. I mean, a hundred bucks is like a good pair of earbuds that play music. Mm -hmm. It's cool that people are out there trying to solve problems. Ultimately, I answer 
to them. Maybe you can bring these to a concert and then adjust your volume like that instead of just wearing full on earplugs. I've seen those on Amazon before that are cheap. Yeah. yeah. I just feel like the promise is better than the delivery. I gotta give you something. All right, you tune in, you trust me, you put me here. You're gonna be mad at me if I told you to get that. No uh, hard feelings here, Well, Not at all. No need for the whole emotional tirade. Maybe after they see this video, they'll offer up a discount code. I don't know, if you're listening. I'm not saying it's a bad product. I'm saying it's a bad price. And I do this for my people.